We thought it'd be fun to try and construct an NHL roster by being able to only select one player per country. Before we jump in, let's lay down some ground rules. It's got to be a 23-man roster consisting of two goalies, seven defensemen, and 14 forwards. The player selected must have played in the NHL last year unless no such player exists from his country. Where we give ourselves some flexibility is we can either select a player based on where he's born or what country he represents in national competition. Occasionally, we had to bend the rules a bit to make the roster work, but we'll call ourselves out when this happens. Let's get into it. Let's start by picking countries with one or a few options so we can fill in roster gaps from countries with more players later. That's why we're selecting Daniel Sprong from the Netherlands. The Dutchman was born in Amsterdam, but due to the lack of hockey programs in his home country, he and his family moved to Quebec when he was eight years old. Next, we find ourselves selecting Arthur Kaliev. Kaliev was born in Uzbekistan, but his family moved to Staten Island when he was two years old. You may remember him winning gold as a member of the 2021 Team USA World Junior Team. While we had a few other options for Belarus, Yegor Sharangovich is easily the best choice as he's amassed 76 points in 130 NHL games, so that's who we're taking. This one is a slam dunk pick in every sense of the phrase. Andre Kopitar has had an incredible career, especially considering he hails from the hockey obscure country of Slovenia. The two-way forward joins our roster. The roster's looking like it's going to be forward heavy, so with our next pick, we select Roman Yossi from Switzerland. We take advantage of the fact that one of the best defensemen in the game hails from a smaller hockey country. For our next selection, we're staying in the Dock region and making an obvious choice. We're taking Leon Dreisaitl from Germany. Rounding out the region, we're going to Austria and taking Michael Roffel. Austria has some top prospects such as Marco Rossi and Marco Kasper but they haven't cracked the NHL yet, so we're forced to take an active NHLer with the pick. For our next pick, we're taking Zemgis Gergensens from Latvia. We also considered fellow countryman Teddy Bluger with this pick, but Gergensens gets the nod. Coincidentally, they were both selected in the 2012 NHL draft. Next, we add some speed to our lineup by going with Matt Zuccarello out of Norway. Not that we really had a choice, as he's currently the only active NHLer from the country. Here, we originally were thinking of taking Frederick Anderson to fill one of our goaltending spots, but Nikolai Ellers is just too good of a talent to pass up, and we'll find other ways to find a netminder. Speaking of which, we landed on Alexander Georgiev out of Bulgaria for our next pick. Although he represents Russia in international competition, he is the first Bulgarian-born player to make it to the NHL. While we're focused on the net, we're going to round out our goalie selections and take Georgiev's former teammate, Igor Shosturkin. As the reigning Vesna Trophy winner, the Russian netminder gives us a strong foundation. The reigning Vezina Trophy winner, the Russian netminder, gives us a strong foundation. We have a few options for France, such as Antoine Roussel and Alexander Texier. However, needing a bit of jam in the lineup, we take Pierre-Edouard Belmar. Originally, we had Connor McDavid penciled in for our Canada slot. However, we really need some help on the back end, so instead we're selecting reigning Norris and Conn Smythe Trophy winner, Kale Makar. We're sticking to defense with the next pick and taking another Norse Trophy winner. We use our Sweden selection on Victor Hedman. After taking defensemen back-to-back, -back, we give ourselves some space to take another forward. With our USA pick, we're able to snag Austin Matthews, who's coming off of a Richard and Hart Trophy winning season. Although we have quality defensemen, we still need more to fill out our roster. Therefore, with our Finland selection, we're taking Miro Haskinen, who still has plenty of upside. We're looking strong in the middle with the likes of Matthews, Kopitar, and Dreisaitl, but we can use some more talent on the wing. So with our Czech Republic pick, we're taking David Pasternak. We don't venture far with our next pick. Still needing defensemen, we take Zdeno Chara from Slovakia. 
Although he's currently unsigned and his future is in question, he did play last season and we can use his veteran leadership. Completing out our top six defensemen is Jordan Spence from Down Under. The Australian-born defenseman played 28 games for the Los Angeles Kings last year. Spence was born in New South Wales and lived in Japan before moving to Prince Edward Island at the age of 13. This is where we get creative. Nathan Walker is well documented as an Australian making it to the NHL. However, we used our Australian pick on Spence. Well, we found a loophole in that. Nathan Walker was born in Cardiff, Wales. So we're taking him with our UK pick. We have our starting roster completed, but we still need our three extras. This is where we get creative. We're selecting Leo Komarov out of Estonia. Although he represents Finland in international play, Komarov was born in Narva in Estonian SSR, Soviet Union. He last played for SKA St. Petersburg, but did play one game for the New York Islanders last season. This is where we really stretch the rules. We're taking Nikolay Zherdev from Ukraine. Although he represents Russia in international play, he was born in Kiev. He hasn't played in the NHL since being a member of the Philadelphia Flyers during the 2011-2012 season, but was an active player last year playing in the ICEHL. For our final pick, surprise, surprise, we need a defenseman. We're selecting Viktor Antipin, who was born in Kazakhstan but represents Russia in international play. He last played for the Buffalo Sabres during the 2017-2018 season. And we should note, goaltender Anton Hudobin was also born in Kazakhstan, but we're cutting ourselves some slack so we can finish the roster. You can review the full roster below in the description. How do you think we did? How would this team fare in the NHL? Let us know.